I love it when a plan comes together. We've got the wire in, thanks to my boy. And uh, he'll show you how he built the door and how we pulled the wire through to connect the pieces of four foot wire together. So my son, Bart, is going to explain how he built this door. And uh, go ahead, Bart. Basically on the 2x4s, uh, I just, instead of cutting them in half and then squishing them together, I cut right in the, about the middle, not exact, but I only went about two-thirds of the way in, and then I pushed the chicken wire in with the screwdriver, because some of it didn't want to go in very easy. So it was a little extra work, but, uh, and then I cut the halves here so the corners would merge together. If I'd measured it, it'd be more flush, but it worked out pretty good. The the cut was the same cut all the way around, so it lined up. That was pretty much scrap wood, wasn't it? Yeah. Yeah, this was part of Out pallet of pallets. Yeah. Extra stuff. And so, yeah, it worked out good for putting it all together. And, and then uh, for Dad's drying, we got the extra support in the corners. <laughs> you know, and it worked good. It holds <laughs> up pretty well. Yeah. Uh, <coughs> so me. it's it's pretty straight. We could add some extra cross support, but so far it's pretty solid. Um, of course, the, as you see, this is crooked, but the chickens won't care. Pretty solid. And then uh, <coughs> inside, what we did for the, the wire. Um, it's kind of hard to see in here. We got the little wire. This is what came with the chicken wire wrapped up. We kind of zoop, fed it through uh, all the way around and up above. Uh, we've got the thicker electrical fence wire and it just fed right on through and we did anywhere it had to seam together and uh, it's going to be pretty, pretty tight. Not going to have any issues there. I think it's done pretty fair. I was going to use some uh, J-hooks that I use on my rabbit cages, but I couldn't find my pliers nor the J-hooks. So I had to revert back to Barton's suggestion, and his suggestion saved us a lot of time, and we just used material that we had. So sometimes you got to listen to your kids because they uh, they got pretty good, pretty good ideas. So the chickens are ready. 
and we're going to release the chickens because we don't have any babies to release. Okay. Release the chickens. Let's see if those suckers will come out. We're going to open the door and see if we can't scare them out. They've been in there for a week, so they probably think this was... That makes me feel so good that my chickens love our chicken barn. Oh, the rooster is first. It takes a rooster, doesn't it? Lead them girls out here. Oh, yeah. Four hands. Now they're out. Hallelujah, Barton. We get to get out of that sun for today. Tomorrow is Sunday. Today's Saturday. And, uh, you know, this is a family ordeal. And uh, Barton and I have worked together hard on this thing in the heat. And, and uh, you know, I think there was one day in the rain a little bit. And we've just uh, kept at it. And blood. With a little bit of blood <laughs> sacrifice. Yes, there has been. <laughs> And uh, no blackened wire. fingernails, but yeah, there's been some pokes and some from the wire and so forth. Yeah. Uh, but uh, what do you think of that, chickens? Uh, they're it's not easy. saying too much right now, but you know, they're young yet. I mean, they're only uh, oh seven weeks. So you know, hey, I'm real happy about this and. Uh, I kind of think that, uh, I got to back off a little bit. I kind of think that this has worked out pretty good. Yep. And uh, now that we have our chicken barn and our chicken coop together, man, we can get down to doing some other stuff. And am I happy or what? This has been a back breaking, knee, knee straining uh, project. And those screw, screws and hatchet uh, hinges and uh, what do they call them? Hooks and all that stuff. That man, that cost more than I thought they would. Uh, that's where the money was in that hardware. That's that's why uh, Lowe's and all those stores seem to make the big bucks. Well, we only got one thing left to say. What do you say when a job's done? Let's get out of here. <laughs> Good job, Bart. Good job. Thank you, Dad. Good job, Dad. <laughs> Thank you, Bart. Appreciate it. <laughs> hey, man. Whew. Yeah, let's let's go uh, get into some of Mama's cookies. <laughs> Our ice cream. Yeah, I'm I'm all for that. <laughs>